When Ray Tenzing was tried for murder in November, the jury went 25 hours before calling it quits. That trial ended in a hung jury. Jurors in his retrial have now surpassed that time frame, and there's still not a verdict. Local 12's Anjanette Levy now with why it might be taking so long. The jury broke for the evening around 4 o'clock. That means they've deliberated for about 25 and a half hours. Today we found out they asked one question, but the attorneys answered that question in chambers, so no one knows what they asked. I think they are debating what is the most heinous homicide because that gets the tag for murder. Christo Lassiter teaches criminal procedure at UC's law school. Lassiter believes voluntary manslaughter is the more appropriate charge in this case. He said charging Ray Tenzing with murder in Sam DeBose's death could have complicated the matter. The jurors cannot deliberate the voluntary manslaughter charge until they've reached a verdict on the murder charge. I think they're working very hard to get to that resolution. It's harder because you have a police officer involved where there's obviously deference uh, to the use of guns. But uh, they seem to be in it to get uh, a result. They're, they're not going to be hung like the, the last jury. So I, I do applaud them for that. And once again, the jurors will return to the courthouse at 8.30 tomorrow morning. At the Hamilton County Courthouse, Anjanette Levy, Local 12 News. And when there is a verdict, we'll carry that live on Local 12 at our website. And if you have the app, you'll get a text alert when the verdict comes in. You can sign up for that under the News tab at Local12.com.